It's the first day of the 104th Cinco de Mayo Festival in Omaha. Each year, the festival grows and has new things to offer. This year, it's attracted people from near and far to enjoy the celebration. KETV Newswatch 7's Jessica Perez, Jessica Perez talked with locals and tourists about their favorite attraction. The festival kicked off today at 5 o'clock here on South 24th Street. And while there are some people leaving, there it is still going strong. There's still a lot of people here enjoying the rides. Like this carousel over here, still plenty of kids and people in line. I spoke with some of the festival goers earlier today who tell me there's a little something for everyone here. The cheerful screams of kids spinning around on carnival rides signify the start of Omaha's three-day Cinco de Mayo festival. It's a place where those young or those with many years of wisdom can enjoy games and blocks full of vendors. Armando Gutierrez brought his family to enjoy the live music and maybe get in some dancing. He's impressed with the event's changes. Before, there wasn't this much security, so this makes it so much better. With officers posted at entrances and security wanding people, it makes him feel safer. Esther Cortez has come to the festival for years and says it's gotten larger each time. This year, she's enjoying the sunshine most. Here, people watching, they should have fun because when you get older, you're in a different phase of life. James Davis says it's a great way to get him out of the house. He's already visited some of the booths. I just enjoy life and, you know, I just... I hate being inside. I love to get out and, and, and watch people. And tomorrow they said the, the dancers are going to be here. For Teriana, food is the biggest attraction. I'm always craving Mexican food when I'm six months pregnant, so I came and I'm very satisfied. I've already found my mangoes. She says Cinco de Mayo is unlike any other festival hosted in Omaha. Coming here, the food is different, the vibe is different, you know, the music is different, so it's a different experience than what we're used to. It's caught the attention of tourists like Andy Peña from Chicago, who wanted to join in on the celebration as a vendor. Muy, muy, We've had really good sales. He learned about it through social media and says the event paints a beautiful picture of Omaha. We've heard great things. This is our second year and we are happy to be here. The event runs until Sunday and tomorrow is the parade that a lot of people are looking forward to. It's here on South 24th Street and it starts at 9.30 a.m. Live in Omaha, Jessica Perez, KTV News Watch 7. All right, Jessica, hope you've had some fun too.